Okay, I just had a, a, a demo of the closed captioning headsets uh, with, in the Sony suite at Show East here. These are the, the head-mounted uh, glasses, basically, that a, a patron would wear. Uh, there are actually two options. One is to, um, has to use this connector to create closed captions that are viewable. Uh, there's also an audio uh, output uh, to get um, uh, the soundtrack, uh, so you kind of use one or the other, but not, not both. Um, I had a little bit of trouble uh, adjusting it because I didn't get the proper instructions. Uh, it turns out you need to use this, uh, this nose bridge, there's a little bit of adjustment there, to get the right height where, uh, relative to your, to your eyes. And then the, you can also adjust the, uh, the glasses, angle them up and down to move the captions up and down on the screen. Uh, so once it was in position, it was actually very easy to adjust. Uh, image quality is quite, uh, quite good. Uh, it overlays the screen very nicely. Uh, the letters are, are crisp and, and clear. Uh, there are three focal length uh, adjustments, uh, near, medium, and far. Uh, I'm not sure what it was set for me, um, but I wanted it to be a little bit further away. Um, there was definitely a, a separation between the captions uh, where they were in, in, in depth space and the screen plane. Uh, so I would obviously prefer to have it uh, at the screen plane. Uh, so uh, I don't know if that far depth would be uh, far enough yet, but that's something uh, uh, that's, this is a first generation product from Sony, so they'll be listening to feedback like that and, and perhaps making some adjustments. Um, now it is a, uh, a micro display uh, is positioned, there's two micro displays, one on each side, that inject uh, the closed captioning into this planar uh, waveguide, which is, uh, sits in front of your eye. Uh, they call it a holographic uh, projector, so there's, it's some kind of optical element uh, that's inside this planar waveguide uh, that extracts the image and creates the virtual image uh, at a distance away from you. Uh, they're working on a white paper right now, which will give a little bit more technical details. Uh, so when we get that, uh, we'll try and uh, pass that along too. Um, so this is a, um, a wireless uh, communication protocol, 2.4 gigahertz. Uh, and uh, the system can support uh, up to six languages, obviously one at, at a time. Uh, but uh, actually, can you, can, if there, can you transmit six different languages simultaneously? Yes, and the, the receiver can be programmed to any of the six channels. Okay, perfect. Uh, for language, we support up to more than, 50, uh, more than 56 languages to date currently. Wow, that's excellent. Thank you.